Hey, welcome back. Ray, what's the matter? Something happened, didn't it? I've never heard you silent. I didn't think this kind of thing happened here. <laughs> so you were already riding the bus when the hijacker got on? Yeah. It's a little hard to believe that that was all a coincidence, don't you think? What do you mean? Doesn't that suggest that you... That's enough. <laughs> but... Yeah, I guess you're right. It's just force of habit. Sorry about that. No, I should be sorry. Let's forget about it. Your mind will be occupied with better things, too. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. No, he was... He was murdered by Kira. That day, Ray said that he was... That same day, four people died of heart attacks in the Shinjuku area, and... That's it. Kira can kill in other ways. It doesn't have to be a heart attack. I have information relating to the Kira investigation. Find him before El does. His cell phone is off at the moment, but I should be able to contact him soon. Besides, I feel like I can trust her. You can almost see it in her eyes. She's a wise and careful person. <gasps> Phone and let you talk to him. You sure that's all right? Thank you so much. My name's Shoko Maki. It's written with the characters for Shining. Ko is in Child, Space and Key is in Tree. So do I. It's odd that you say that because that's exactly what I've been thinking. Kira's able to control their actions before he kills them, but there's more to it. Kira can kill in a number of ways, not just with a heart attack. You know, that possibility never even crossed my mind. So what you're saying is anytime Kira wants one of his murders to go undetected, he wouldn't use a heart attack. Right. I'm almost positive that someone I know may have met Kira. Because eight days after that bus was hijacked, what stands out to me is that the hijacker died in an accident. In other words, it suggests that heart attacks aren't the only way Kira can kill people. I've been wondering about that bus jacking ever since my fiancé first told me about it. After he calmed down, I asked him for details. That he'd been put in a situation where he had to show his FBI ID. I think whoever saw his ID that day is responsible for the deaths of all the agents. And now you're convinced that Kira can kill without using a heart attack? Yes. There's no doubt in my mind your deductive skills are excellent, but you can't deny that you have a personal interest in the case. Still, your testimony could be central to the case. It could. That's right. This woman. If she'd spoken to the police before I met her. But... Something wrong? Oh, it's nothing. What? Really? Do you mean that? Yes. So, have you told anyone else about this? No, you're the first person I've told. Well, if it's all the same, I think I'd like to report it myself. And after talking to you, I've decided that it would be best to do it as soon as possible. Ryuk knew all along. He could see her real name with his eyes. That's why he wouldn't stop laughing. I should have known. She's been overly cautious from the beginning. Alias. I should probably be getting back soon. Yeah. yeah. Uh, do you still have business at the police station then? I'd like to go there by myself, if you don't mind. I've got to find out a real name, then eliminate her quickly. Huh? I can't contact anyone, but why not? Shh. I see. That's why you were told earlier that no one was at Task Force Headquarters. If this is supposed to be a secret, then how do you know so much? Very well. You leave me no choice. I'm sorry, you're telling me that you're an agent? Yes. El I can go to Task Force Headquarters whenever it suits me, and I'm allowed to investigate freely as I see fit. You see, these days the task force is made worthy. Hmm. 
Thanks for explaining. But just to be safe, I'd like to try and visit the task force headquarters again. Uh-huh. Goodbye. You may be right, but I think that there's a chance that he'll meet with me. Yes, I didn't tell you this, but up until three months ago, I worked as an FBI agent. From the beginning, I knew I had to do things outside the regular channels, because from my perspective, both the police and the members of the task force were suspects. But I'm certain that I can trust Elle. Maybe it's unrealistic. But I think that if I go to headquarters and I give them my name, there's a chance that they'll let me speak with him directly. It's because you remind me of Elle. Your own. You have all the experience as an FBI agent. You're more talented than most of the detectives currently on the task force, and Elle obviously trusted you in the past. You want me to join the task force? It's true. Before all this happened, I thought I'd continue living in America with my fiancé. We planned on getting married in the spring. But now he's gone, so I'm not sure what to do anymore. No! Now that Ray's gone, I've got nothing to lose anymore! I want to catch Kira. I don't care about anything else. It's all I want to do. Please let me investigate this case with you. Oh, um... You see the name I gave you earlier? Well, it wasn't actually my real name. I'm so sorry. Uh, so... If you don't mind my asking, why do you keep checking your watch? 